Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm SFG and today I'm going to be showing you my latest collection, my latest brats to my collection that I got from the thrift store. And I have this little brats and as you can see I haven't done anything with them so I'm going to show you how I fix them. And then I have this brats babies. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so one of the first things you would probably want to do is you would want to remove your clothing and wash that out and you can choose what you can use. I usually use soap and water, but another thing to make sure is that when you're using soap or any other liquid, first of all, don't use any strong liquid like detergents and stuff. You can ruin your doll and your doll clothes, but be careful at the, like, the eye area, the lip area. Don't like scrub so hard. So that's why I usually don't buy dolls that have like massive problems or problems. I just buy them if they're pretty and will look good and if it's something I want in my collection that's so like okay. So I'm just going to remove this and this I'm going to wash of course and then I'm also going to wash her hair. And I'm going to rinse out her hair because it does need some cleaning. I recommend even if your doll is in top condition I'd still recommend them to wash everything because it's been in the thrift store and who knows how it's been in the home before even if it looks pretty and clean and all that so I'm just removing the elastic carefully there and I'm just gonna wash her hair and wash her body and I'm also gonna wash her the like bath thing which didn't come with her originally because um, it came in the first store but like because this is for these other Bratz babies I don't know if you can tell but I think it's still really nice to have something for her so yeah is that if depending on if you feel like your doll's hair is sort of sticky or like icky <laughs> yes sticky icky then feel free if you have something that works good to go with shampoo but it has to be a um, like no strong shampoo and if you use shampoo I have never done that and I won't do it but then don't like scrub it in just let it run through sort of the hair so don't mix it in and you can also use conditioner or whatever I know that some people do that just remember to be careful what you use and to not like work it into the hair because then you know it will be like left so you just want to like let it slide through the doll's hair okay so now I've come to the little brat so first of all I'm going to remove her shoes from her feet from the pegs and I'm gonna rinse through those. And make sure that when you put them to dry, that the peg is like downwards so that you don't have any, oh sorry, that you don't have any liquid in it. So like this or so. So I'm just gonna start washing her. So now that I've fixed them all up and everything is dry, I thought I'd show you and tell you what I did with her hair since I didn't show you that. So what I did, well mostly with um, the Bratz Baby since I haven't made any name for them yet, um, is that I just brushed, I took and let it dry a bit and after that I took my brush and comb for my doll and then I just um, sectioned into small sections like maybe not bigger than this or so and I started over here at the like little bangs part and I just brushed and combed through it to get rid of excess water and also to make it nice and smooth since it was a bit like tangly and so and I got this and I thought I would curl it like this but I decided to skip that and then I just braided from this side all over here and then I took the 
a little part and put the bangs underneath and then just clipped it with this little mini clip since I didn't use an elastic. And then I put her in this little outfit where it says Rebel on it and these little pants and these shoes and I didn't realize until after I dressed both of them that this outfit is very similar to this, it's like the same idea. But I think she looks really good in this outfit, so I really like it on her. And um, so I just continued brushing anyway with sectioning the hair off until I had everything nice and smooth and then I brushed everything together. But here I didn't do so much, I just brushed through and, you know, combed through. Since she did have it like high up and bent, so I decided to go, instead of having it totally flat and like down, I chose to do a little side ponytail. And then I put on the outfit again. And she looks really good in it. And it will go really great to my collection because I have one little brats from before. And also, I would like to know, leave in the comment section down below if you have any name ideas for these two. And also, if you would like to see a video on all my brats babies and little brats, since I haven't done a video on that. And I also should maybe do an updated brats collection video since I've gotten a couple new ones. So leave in the comment section down below if you would like to see that. Um, so as always, I think this is about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!